We are poised for exponential growth in human learning if people shift their closed mindsets to a growth mindset where everyone realizes their unlimited learning potentials. The tyranny of the bell curve has crippled education. The next generation will need to be more and more comfortable with problems of dizzying complexity so they feel they can be the change agents of tomorrow. But education must reinvent itself. Like the legend of the phoenix born again and rising from the ashes of its predecessor, this pandemic presents an extraordinary opportunity to reimagine education, reborn, when we repurpose, retool, and redeploy teaching and learning with transformative technology tools. Research has continually validated unlimited learning potentials in humans. In his book, Disruptive Classroom Technologies, a Framework for Innovation in Education, Dr. Sunny Magana provides compelling evidence to verify the power of technology to fundamentally alter student learning. As seen in his T3 framework, Stages of Technology Use, his research proves that strategic, not random, implementation of technology can create transcendent student learners and multi-year gain in student learning. But he also states, unfortunately, Despite the surge of technology in schools, we are a nation technology rich and innovation poor. Without reliable systems to ensure teacher capacity building, dedicated teachers need to take the lead, become professional learners, entrepreneurs, and become adaptive experts to keep up with a fast changing world. Dr. Margana's T3 framework provides teachers a roadmap for change. It describes incremental identifiers of instructional learning practices that would help meaningfully and accurately guide teachers to higher levels of innovative teaching and learning practices. The provocative question guiding this research and teachers' technology decisions is, how can students use technology to represent what they know, what they're able to do, and how they think in ways that are not possible without technology? Part one of this repurpose, retool, redeploy education wakelet is designed to help teachers climb this hierarchical scale, help them make strategic decisions on what resources to use to help them move from the lowest level, translational, to transformational, to transcendent, where student passion and inquiry yield unanticipated depth and understanding and autonomy. Part two provides support for parents, students, and teachers. It suggests tools to help them fill learning gaps provide remediation or acceleration. This video is a brief overview of the organizational structure of these resources, designed to lead heroic teachers on their transcendent learning journeys. The first entry, Sam Carey's video on how to use education technology, is a virtual candy store of delicious technology options for teachers. Seeing the power of these will inspire teachers to take risks. Under teacher resources, the first step is for teachers to expand their personal learning networks, connecting to other teachers through Twitter, Facebook, and teacher blog links that we provide. Inquiring teachers will find themselves inspired by reading EdTech teachers' books. Buying one of these books is a wonderful way to support these transcendent teachers who provide an abundance of free resources on their sites. Teachers should consider growing their skill sets by taking free classes offered by EdTech experts. These are just two of the many free distance learning courses available online. Then teachers need to do their own independent research on intriguing topics of interest inside large databases like Common Sense Media, which is everything media, not just technology, but it is overwhelming. It offers Yelp type ratings, legal compliance information for schools. It provides the what, but not necessarily the how. Another more informative database is Wakelets. These provide more detailed information on how teachers deploy various technologies. A search in Wakelets can help teachers uncover resources to teach essential distance learning skills, such as how to use one's learning management system and tools like Flipgrid and Pear Deck and Seesaw. For teachers struggling to engage students, Nearpod offers 8,000 standards-based interactive lessons that promote transformative and transcendent thinking. They upload to the LMSs, their teacher pace, synchronous, student pace, asynchronous. They embed powerful response tools 
and even virtual reality lessons. To engage students, teachers should learn several gamified, authentic, formative assessment tools like quizzes, cahoots, and Quizlet. They not only promote joyful learning, they provide actionable data to inform teachers' decisions. When moving up the ladder of technology implementation, teachers should consider experimenting with transcendent activities created by transcendent teachers. Many provide free classes on how best to design distance learning. These are just some of the educational game changers who have created free materials, resources that promote more complex thinking in students. They design all-inclusive learning ecosystems that promise to alter your teaching and learning. An example of an activity that elevates teaching to a transcendent level and reframes thinking is edu protocols. This website's instructional lesson frames are designed to engage students in learning through critical thinking, collaboration, communication, and creativity. They can be used with any subject, any grade level, and will empower student learning during remote learning. For example, Kimberly Vogue's perfect edu protocol week demonstrates how she infuses high level thinking all week. Any teacher can copy these, recast them for their own content, and implement them immediately. Matt Miller's Ditch That Textbook website offers resources across platforms, Microsoft, Google. Also, note he has direct training for remote learning and Flipgrid. To relieve teacher anxiety during these uncertain times, Matt just released an extraordinary resource, 50 back to school activities to teach remote learning in the classroom. Hyperdocs are also genius critical thinking frames that when used create transcendent learning. These are pre-made templates that invite students to engage, explore, explain, reflect, share, and extend. On our website, see a teacher-created pandemic hyperdoc focusing on empathy and social injustice. We didn't want you to miss this free teaching digitally course offered by Nadine Gillickson. It's perfect training for teachers wanting to learn new or advanced skills. The next section provides wicked problem resource links, activities that are designed to engage students in deep and complex thinking learning environments so they ultimately feel like they can solve some of the world's biggest problems. Nothing says wicked problem solving more than STEAM, science, technology, engineering, arts, and math. The lesson design required students to ask questions, imagine, plan, create, test, improve, and share. We include Eric Kurtz's outstanding STEAM links, but teachers can search STEAM and Wakelet and find numerous other project ideas. Minecraft EDU is digital STEAM, the ultimate resource for collaboratively solving wicked problems. For example, in one lesson, groups of four students were tasked to create museums a thousand years in the future and then create artifacts that haven't been invented yet. Minecraft EDU is a project-based immersive learning platform. It's a completely different ecosystem than the Minecraft game. The project are teacher-created, standards-based challenges that range from fundamental skills, digital citizenship, and bullying, to complex concepts like climate change. When Alice Keeler, a well-respected author and Google Classroom guru, tweeted her shock and awe over her child's accomplishments in Minecraft, she expressed a transcendent epiphany. She was gobsmacked by her own child's unlimited learning ability. The next day, I was equally stunned with a 10-year-old who demonstrated how he used Python coding to build a bridge in a parkour game he was creating for a friend. Due to the limitations on this video, the part two, teacher, student, parent, resources, are self-explanatory and organized by content. If parents or students are receiving poor distant learning teaching, this is where they can fill the gaps. On this list, companies like Scholastic are providing complete curriculums for free. And the student resources you will find reading, writing, math, science, creativity. You will find numerous reading links, fiction, nonfiction, current events. For students who have a hard time focusing, many of these websites read the text aloud. One noteworthy link is Wonderopolis. It includes Microsoft's Immersive Reader. Immersive Reader is a revolutionary breakthrough in providing reading accessibility for all students. It translates for English language learners. It provides strategic focus for students with ADHD and dyslexia. 
On our website, please see the video showing how to access Immersive Reader in Wondropolis. This is also embedded in other programs like Nearpod and Pear Deck. In addition to Khan Academy's gold standard math instruction for distance learning, there are 75 plus outstanding math links. For example, Brain Genie CK12 offers a full K-12 math science curriculum. This nonprofit was so concerned about inequities in remote teaching, they created an exceptional math science fill the gap course for sixth through 12th grade. Math Playground is also noteworthy because in addition to grade level math games, hidden inside this amazing program is thinking blocks. These are incredible interactive math word problem solving activities. We stand on the precipice of hope. Due to the internet, never has there been more opportunities to learn. We're urging teachers to take the leap into new ways to promote student learning. This weary world needs thinkers and doers who create for the sake of learning, not a grade. To quote Fast Company, after observing students in a design camp experiment, they said they were left with a conviction that together we can entangle design and learning and thus invent a new literal, visual, and spatial language. This language will give us a lexicon to support a radically new map and experience for learning and teaching. As we stand at the threshold decade of the third millennium, generations of world-changing minds are at stake. In Matt Miller, Nate Ridgway, and Angela Ridgway's book, Don't Ditch That Tech, I was inspired by Matt's dedication to all the educators who think there has to be a better way and to do something about it. May some of the resource on this wakelet help you see, think, and wonder if there's not a better way to ignite student passion to inspire them in a burning desire to improve this world. When teachers and students embark on a technology hero's journey, it will require exceptional courage and self-sacrifice on their parts. To become a leader, they will endure trials, successes, and failures as they move from the known to the unknown, sometimes feeling they are falling into the abyss, but then forever transformed after they mastered the two worlds, evolved, vindicated, and renewed, knowing that they are now the change agents designing the future. All right, I'm not so sure. There should not be a warning label on this wakelet saying, Danger. Consuming too much information can cause dizziness, nausea, and a rash. For those of you who want to learn new things and didn't know where to start, well, now you know. Technology is a rabbit hole, but when you land, you end up in technology wonderland. Though it may seem self-serving, I placed the link to this wakelet on my comedy website, ClaireOnMedicare.com, because Claire on Medicare dot com is a lot easier to remember than https gibberish. <laughs>